All right, TS tournament number four. We have advanced. We are now in round five. Last time we beat Octopus Aldock. Now we are in one, one, two, three, four, five. We are battling Clutch. We are now in the final eight players. Also, some good news. The final community tour is top 16 players. We have earned enough to make it into the top 16. So we've done very well. This is not our last tournament. We'll be playing some more. So our battle with Clutch is about to begin. Let's go ahead and queue up. All right, we're figuring out the code to queue in. All right, we are doing code Axie. Here we go. Game one about to start. He goes with nature. We go with deception. Let's go with Orpheus distraction, AKA cheat going first. There's a great starting hand. Let's be a little greedy and let's look for a cat. Clutch with an order board. Looks like mine. He has a trinket up here. Looking pretty good. All right, let's go ahead and start with a uh, fellow assassin and just pass. Canopy barrage. All right, respecting the fellow assassin. I think we go bedeviled shadow here. Can we? We can't really drop the a naked axe woman. So let's bag out the uh, bedeviled shadow here. Let's see if he has an answer for that again. Oh, nice answer. Underbrush bore clears off our bedeviled shadow cleanly. Nice counterplay there, Clutch. Oh, now we're stuck. All right, so now we just got to do Axe Woman now. Uh, we will have to uh, cheat it and hide it. Nothing else to do. All right, so it's not a good start for us now. We, we went first, and he took care of our... our fellow assassin easily, and then he took care of our Bedevil Shadow. That was a bigger, bigger move right there. Getting our Bedeviled Shadow out of the way was pretty key. Let's just go face here. Start getting some favor. Some Agrodor Protector action there. Pretty nice. We do have a clean play with the Dark Knives here. Let's go ahead and give this guy Dark Knives. Clean that off. Drop the AOD. Go face. Lightning Strike, okay. Does he get the lucky? No, he does not get lucky. All right, we're at nine. Nine favor. Let's go ahead and get this. We'll be at 12. Let's hit this. We can get the improviser. 
we get the Arox. Arox 3 attack. I think I'm going to go here with the um, Improviser. Take our chance to go wide with a big foreign diplomat here. A 4-2, 4-3, I mean. Okay, so we, we might have missed some damage here. I could have Dark Knives here earlier, which I think I should have, and pushed three more damage. Right, does he have a Hunt? Oh, he does have the Hunt. Oh, no, he has the Rhino. Okay. I thought he had the Hunt there. So we could get rid of the, so we can go five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, let's go ahead and get rid of him. Let's hit him for seven. Cheat him out of the way. We can get the Aurox next turn. Or this turn, actually, I mean. Let's pump up the Aurox. So he's looking for a hunt here. Another Rhino. Nice, nice. So we have four, five, six, seven, eight damage. We could push eight. So I think we just uh, cheat and push face here. Let's just put lots of health on the board. We could get this to seal the win next turn. Oh, we got the turn. I'm sorry, we miscounted. We already had the win. Miscounting there. GG clutch. All right, we won with nature. We're going to have to switch decks here. Let's go ahead and go with um, our nature. We're probably expecting light, maybe. I'm expecting light. So... We're going to go ahead and queue in to our second game here. We're going with nature. We're expecting light. Clutch is thinking hard, probably making some deck changes here. All right, we're queuing for a bit. He's not ready yet. Here we go. We're queuing in. Game two. All right, good luck, Clutch. Game two. Sticks with nature. All right. Let's go with Animal Bond. So he probably changed his list up now. We are going first. We don't need a Lightning Strike yet. This is a pretty good opening hand here for us. Let's stick with this. Marsh Walker into the Trial Spirit. Very strong opening. If 
followed up the heavy. So this nullifies his canopy barrage because he could potentially miss, or even if he hits here, we survive. So that's a strong play right there with the Jaggy. So we could just push the um, the tempo here. We could clean up the Jaguar next turn after it misses. I think Jaguar would want to go here. Um, these two aren't really good targets for it, unless he has something to clean up the other two after a Jaguar attack. We shall see. All right, he's really pondering what to do. Oh, he got it. Nice attack there. So now he could take a chance with a canopy barrage. That's what I'm thinking. Okay, he's taking a while. The Jaguar went, I think the Jaguar went where he wanted to go. Okay, underbrush bore, tough choice there because I get that trade. All right, so we take this. Um, so we could drop the Jag here and do, or we could hit here. So I think we just go wide, right? I don't think we trade here. We let him try to trade. He could hit the Jag into the Jag. We don't really care. Or do we God power here? One, three, two. Okay, I'm thinking if we need to put the Jag here, the Jag hits into the Jag. I think we put the Jag here. We play the Jag. Okay, let's make sure we got the attacks in. All right. So he's going to try to go here, I believe. He has two good, three good targets now. He got the good one. That's a very good target for him. Primal Guidance, trying to do two damage. Bad target there. So he's going to probably God Power, maybe, or does he have a Relic? Another Primal Guidance. Okay. He got the Jaguar. Wow, good aim on there. And the canopy. Ooh, emptied out his hand. All right, all right. I see you. I see you. Okay, we don't really, we're not able to do anything here. We just hit and summon a god power here. Uh, I know Clutch plays rhinos and stuff, so we're going to save the lightning strike. We do have a uh, ogre archer next turn. That jag is putting in a lot of work. Maybe we should have traded in already earlier. But he, he's running a lot of spells. Fey Fame Blade. Good pickup. Got the hit there, nice. Hit the God Power. He can buy probably the Archer here. Ring of Sight, drawing for cards, okay. Okay, we clean out his Jaguar. Jaguar Dark Protector with the Marsh Walker. So I don't think we want to hit a 50 50 here because that's not really the best thing to do right now. Um,
do we do an ambitious, ambitious adventure here? That's the question. I think we saved this. We don't need the ambitious adventure. Let's play. Let's just go wide and wait next turn. Yeah, I think wide is the play here. Into the Jagstaff. Nice. Okay, nice play with the jack stuff there. So we go ahead and clear this guy off the board, right? Or do we try to go for our lucky canopy? Lucky canopy, god power into this guy. Let's go for a lucky canopy. We wanted to hit this guy right here. The Agrador Protector. We got it. Let's take this guy out right. Or do we go here? I think we hit here. We don't regen, so that's going to be 2 1. This guy can kill us. We think we can go here. Now we go for the Jag. Jack's a little bit more dangerous here. God power. We could go ahead and attack here. It doesn't matter if you miss, we survive. So hopefully he doesn't run the hunt. Hunt would be pretty brutal. Chiron making it a 2-2 Marsh Walker. Nice trade. Jaguar Staff. Good, good board clearing there. Okay, so he has a big creature in hand. He hasn't played it. Okay, so not looking too good here. All right, we have to try to hope and get this. Went face instead. So we're not looking good anymore. Oof, the Oryx. All right, uh, we're not. I don't think we're going to be able to. Um, so that was the card I think he was holding for a while. Not sure we're going to be able to recover from this. We're just going to have to uh, get rid of this guy. God power, and we can't really lightning strike yet. We're going to have to wait. If he drops another big creature. We just pretty much concede. Ambitious adventure. Nice. Gets a card draw with a body. What a great card. Into the Jaguar staff. GG's clutch. Well played. All right, we just pass here. Lightning strike for the funds.
GG's clutch. All right, so now we have to think about changing our deck or not. All right, let's see here. I think we changed the deck here. Let's go for a coin flip here. So deception's out. We can go either nature or we can go, um, hmm. Let's go for a coin flip. I'm feeling, feeling like I might get lucky. All right, we're queuing in. Let's go ahead and queue in. All right, game three. Looking at a light mirror, probably. Light mirror, let's do it. Now right, we're going second. We keep the tracker. We don't need the barter going second. Not the luminary. Olympian guard going second. That's all right. Yeah, I think I'm good with this. Yeah, let's keep, let's stick with this. Bags right into. All right, let's go with the um, answer with a devoted follower. That's a strong opening right there. Answers with his own follower. Pretty strong there. All right, so the health buff doesn't really help us here anymore. Um, best thing we can do is equip the ritual rod. Do we make this a 3-3? Not really, doesn't do anything. We could try to bag out our Olympian guard. He has lights levy, we get hurt, but we could hit here. Nothing, we pass. Okay, lights levy would be really brutal here. There's the lights levy. That's what we were worried about. Now he probably just hits here. Does he make the trade? I guess not. He doesn't need to. But then he'll lose this. I'll lose this. So yeah, he. Do oh, he does make the trade. Okay. Oof. Bad draw for us there. Hit there. Question is, do we drop a trial spirit? No, we just pass. Breaks our relic, strong play. Acolyte into the hog. Archer, okay, okay. 
double archer. Woo! Nice, nice. All right, this is it. We cannot come back from this. Yeah, when light gets a lead like this, and you are playing light as well, you almost very impossible to come back from this. So we are in very rough shape. Pretty certain this is GG's. Yeah, this is this is rough. All right. Yeah, I don't I don't see a way out of this. Going second is light again. The light mirror is very tough. Uh, we knew that though. We took the chance. Um, and then also when they get a white board and they're in this controlling position, very impossible to come back. So, well played to my guy Clutch. Picks up the archer, pings this, and probably trades into it. King pings that away, the 2 1, okay. The Olympian Guard was there since turn one, it's been there for five turns. Insane. Yeah, we're not coming back from this. We just keep playing creatures, but we're done. Trying to make it look like we're it's competitive, but it's not competitive anymore. Oh, Odysseus. Nice. GG's. All right, GG, clutch.